So here's the deal. I've been vegan since 2003. That's back when the one vegan option at restaurants was a plate of iceberg lettuce topped with a few tomato slices. Obviously, we've come a long way since then. In working with my awesome vegan clients, here are the five biggest mistakes I see and hear about all the time. Mistake number five is being a junk food vegan. We all know that vegan does not necessarily mean healthy. I mean, french fries, Oreos, Skittles, chips, they're all vegan. As one of my new clients recently emailed me, I have no clue what my body needs for fuel. I've been eating vegan for a few years now, but I'm a junk food vegan. So don't deprive your body of what it needs and sabotage your fitness goals by eating too much nutritionally empty food. If you need inspiration for healthy eats, on my website, you can download a free vegan grocery list with more than 350 healthy items. Mistake number four is cutting out animal products you used to eat without replacing them. If you just cut out all the animal products you used to eat and don't replace them with a variety of plant-based foods, you're setting yourself up for nutritional deficiency. You're also creating a negative mindset of deprivation like, I can't eat that or I have to avoid that. Instead of focusing on what you can eat and what you can eat more of, including foods you've never tried before. Again, make sure you download the grocery list from my website and I bet you'll find some delicious foods you've never tried before. Rye berries or frika. Did you even know that was a food? Amaranth, orca beans, shirataki noodles, farro, wakame, nutritional yeast. Okay, who am I kidding? All vegans already use nutritional yeast on everything, right? Right? Also, even though you're vegan already, I suggest enrolling in my free how to go vegan 10 day email course, which is also on my website, just to make sure you've nailed the basics and to get some new ideas and inspiration. Mistake number three is not having a bulletproof food architecture in place. Your food architecture is your environment and the habits that you've built that determine what and how you eat. The more bulletproof your architecture, the more likely you are to maintain your health and reach your goals. So I get all of my clients to create a consistent meal prep routine that supports their fitness goals, which very often involves kicking butt in a gym like this, and to schedule some time each week to prepare a large batch of a healthy vegan entree and some grab and go snacks. Also plan your meals ahead. I even put them into my calendar, just like my workouts. And for bonus points, make use of time-saving options like a slow cooker or a grocery delivery company. Check out my book, Vegan Vitality, for more info on how to build a bulletproof food architecture that'll support your vegan nutrition superpowers. Mistake number two is not thinking critically with an evidence-based mindset. Unfortunately, there's a lot of complete bullshit that's often associated with veganism cleanses, detoxes, alkaline diets, juicing, and a host of fad vegan diets like 80-10-10, raw till four, fruitarian, the list goes on. All these things are not supported by research, they're based on a major misunderstanding of how our bodies work, and they're sometimes even harmful. To make sure you're doing something that actually works and isn't harming your health, join our community on Facebook where I keep you in the loop with legit research, debunk BS fads, and show you what to do instead. Mistake number one is that your nutrition isn't supporting your physical activities or your fitness goals. Most physically active vegans, or those who want to be active, don't know how to create a nutrition plan that supports their level of activity and fitness goals. So you need to make sure that you're getting the right number of calories and the right nutrients and ratios thereof. If you don't, you could be sabotaging your fitness results. Plus, it could be dangerous for your body. Most people, vegan or not, don't have a nutrition or fitness plan which is why most people in our population are overweight and unhealthy. To avoid that, you need a tailor-made action plan that will get you the results of your dreams, created by a qualified fitness coach. So by the way, some athletes go vegan mainly to enhance their athletic performance, done right with the help of a coach who gets plant-based fuel. That can be very effective. So if you wanna kick some serious plant-based ass, check out my fitness coaching packages that will give you direction, focus, accountability, know-how, energy, confidence, and health superpowers.